Howdy and welcome to another episode of Breaking the Seal. This is really exciting. This here is our last puppy. This one's name is Maggie Moo. And she's, she's a screamer. She likes to scream a lot. She's very talkative. Anyways, as you can see, she's got this very, there's this almost tan brown coating, but you also got a little bit of dark under there. She's got that little beard going on. Isn't that wonderful? It's almost like peanut butter and chocolate. Peanut butter and chocolate. If you like peanut butter, go ahead and hit the like button. And if you like chocolate, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And if you like both of them, then hit both of them because Maggie really wants you to do that. Maggie's very excited for you to do that. So, what does that have anything to do with what I'm talking about today? I might sneeze. Well, what that has to do with today is we are actually reviewing Reese's Puffs bats isn't that exciting we're back in the halloween times again because i mean i got distracted a little bit but this is this just seems like the perfect dog to go with the perfect cereal don't you think so i think it's just absolutely wonderful wag the tail so this is also an overall very unique situation for me because this is Reese's Puffs Bats Limited Edition, as you can see, from 2023. We're going to go ahead and give a real quick review of this. It's Bats. You got a bat hanging down. You got Reese's Puffs on there. What are you pawing it? Yeah. And then we've also got, uh, look at these little bat shapes down here. Yeah, isn't that wonderful? And on the back, oh my goodness, it's become broken through. We got bats flying out the wazoo they're coming out of the box from the night they're all over the place and that's really neat but what happens if we compare this to 2022's reese's puffs bat cereal isn't that exciting you can even save a whole dollar what are you doing get that fuzzy tang out here you need to be in camera so this is really exciting i get to review both of these back to back they are both still sealed. This is an official breaking the seal. This is, are these bats about the same? Let's go one to one. Um, They're pretty close. I would say they're about the same. There's definitely, you're only gonna get as good as you can get with these, you know? So on the side, we got in large show detail, but in 2022, we have a whole haunted house going on here. Isn't that exciting? An entire haunted house happening. What are you eating? What is that? What do you think you're doing with that little beautiful face? We got tentacles. We got vampires. We got, yeah, that guy. We got witches. What are you eating now? That's my watch charger. And you can even save a whole dollar on, that is my mouse, on your next box of Reese's Puffs. This one is a bargain. You, you are saving money by buying Reese's Puffs. Isn't that exciting? So anyways. Let's go ahead and set both of these up. Get this going. One cup here. Oh, this is going to get complicated with the dog involved in all of this. And a cup here. So, let's go ahead and start opening 2022. Look at his little curly tail. You goofy looking dog. How does 2022 hold up? Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited that it worked out like this. Limited edition, sure. Limited for Halloween. But it comes back every year. It always does. You're eating things that you're not supposed to be eating. How could you? Dog. Am I still recording? Good. All right. Pour this out. Did that get your attention? No, you don't even care. You're just going around doing your own thing. All right. Open up nicely. As to be expected from General Mills Reese's Puffs. You do a great job on that. Still... Dog. What? Mm. All right, this is getting complicated. I used to feed my my um first dog a whole bunch of Reese's Puffs. All right, 2023. How do you compare this? I gotta move quick. Yeah, keep wagging that tail. Very important. It keeps the viewers involved. All right, opened you up. Felt fine. Yeah. Honestly, uh, more difficult to open giving me some concerns but it does eventually open on its own that's wonderful i'm gonna hit the escape button so it's tough stop selecting things you don't know how to work a computer dog Ugh. i'm coming over here wiggle 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 dog 
too much. All right, go ahead and pour this out over here. Okay, 2022 to 2023. These are, they look about the same. Maybe 2023 is a bit more finely, bit better definition on it. Tastes like chocolate, uh, the peanut butter. Okay, this has been in a box for a year and it's starting to taste stale. The packaging has not protected it through the elements of time, which is unfortunate. Great. Um, they're still good. It's Reese's Puffs, so they're good for all times. Do you want one? This is a peanut butter one. Denied! She denied it! Inconceivable! This dog denying food? <clears throat> Okay, well, let's go ahead and get that rolled up. Yeah, give him a little yawn. All right, now, this is Reese's Puffs, and Reese's Puffs is to be held with high regard. So, I will not be tainting my Reese's Puffs with anything but South Mountain Creamery. I am holding it the right direction. So, a fresh bottle of this, fresh little jug. Isn't that wonderful? You can't see my face at all. Let's go ahead and pour some of this. See how we do? That was mostly successful. Dog, look at the camera. All right, so as this stuff is getting wet, Reese's Puffs, bats, the only time Reese's Puffs is really done goofed is with their clusters. I feel like the clusters were just not the correct play for Reese's Puffs. They didn't taste great. Reese's Puffs, original. Reese's Puffs Mini, eh, still on the low end, but not as bad as Clusters. And then Reese's Puffs Big, that was a stellar play. I love that. That was one of my original reviews. I was so happy with that stuff. Bats is still the same thing, I would say, as original Reese's Puffs. It's do you want your Reese's Puffs in a different shape? That's all it really is. Pretty dope, I would say, but... You know, you, you can get what you want. Do you want your kids eating bats or do you, that probably won't age well. Do you want them eating regular Reese's Puffs? So I think these have been sitting around for just long enough that we're gonna get some of that wet taste in there. That's stale. You need to eat your Reese's Puffs before a full year has passed. I think that's very critical. Where do you think you're going? Let's try this one. 2023, how did you do? Perfect, literally perfect. This is why Reese's Puffs is the best cereal on the market. The chocolate and peanut butter just go so perfectly in a bowl together. You can't beat it. There's no other cereal that can do this. They have staked their claim. Everybody wants to try and be a Lucky Charms. I mean, you got all these other Halloween cereals out there where it's literally just the same cereal, but they put the head of the character in a jar and added some ghost marshmallows, literally nothing else. All it is is just a new box, and we added a marshmallow to your cereal. We need something unique. That's where Icy comes in. Fruity Pebbles is kind of staked to claim, because Fruity Pebbles is so much better than Rice Krispies. Mm. They, they really struck gold with that one. Cinnamon Toast Crunch, also is great. The, the top three, Reese's Puffs, Lucky Charms, and Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Those are the big three that we're talking about there. Do I recommend getting this? If it's not... <laughs> a year old still in the box then absolutely and even so i mean i'd still eat it i just love the reese's puffs flavor it's probably going to hang around for a while this is going to disappear quickly in my house i'm not going to let it hang around i might just eat the rest of it today i think that's everything i got to say on this one and i will see you all on the next one Go get a Maggie. go get a Maggie. Maggie. move Maggie. move Maggie Moo! Maggie. Maggie.